Well, so far we have seen long lines at early voting sites, sometimes several hours long. WXI 12's Sarah Sauer shows us what you can do to cut down on some of those wait times. Sarah, good evening. Kenny, this is the fourth voting site we've been to today in Forsyth County, and lines are finally starting to slow down. Now, Forsyth County and Guilford County both have maps available on their websites for you to check on things like wait times, including here, uh, like kind of the things that they have at amusement parks um, to see how long you might have to wait before you get to the polls. Voters we spoke with at one location waited upwards of 30 minutes and chose the precinct because it was close to their home or office. Many say they didn't know about the map and wish they had before they went. We did look over the sample ballot and got a picture of it so we knew what we were doing when we got in here. Yeah, but we didn't, I didn't know there was a map or anything. The few that did know about the resource said it didn't matter as they were willing to wait to cast their ballot. I thought it would be a little bit slacked off actually. Uh, from last week, but it's not. It, the wait's not not bad though. It's it's a nice weather day. You can look at all 18 precincts in Forsyth County using the map through their website and even search by zip code to find the closest early voting place near you. I just checked on those uh, maps shortly, uh, just a short time ago, and it shows that the longest waits right now are upwards of an hour, but the shortest are just a walk through. You can find all those links on our website, WXII12.com. Reporting in Winston-Salem, Sarah Sowers, WXII 12 News.